Hi, my name is Connie Brannon, and I'm a hypnotherapist. I'm going to be guiding you through a few minutes of stress release hypnotherapy. All you got to do is sit down, get comfortable, close your eyes, and listen as my voice and my words guide you into an altered state of mind that we call hypnosis. As this is a very inner focused, peaceful place of mind where we're shutting out external information, it's important to never use this recording while driving or operating machinery. Never. Use this recording when it's safe and appropriate in a place like sitting on a chair, lying on your bed, on the couch, something that is safe and appropriate where it is okay for you to spend some time on yourself and go inward. That's right. Ah, so now we're going to begin. Get yourself comfortable. Find a place where you can just relax for a few minutes. Close your eyes and relax. As you close your eyes and relax, that's an invitation to let go, sink down, become comfortable. A person can relax deeply in just a moment's time. Can one not? You're sitting comfortably. You hear the sound of my voice. You have chosen this time to go into an inner focused mind space. And that means you're unconscious. Mind is guiding you into hypnosis, the perfect level for positive changes and a calm, focused mind. You don't even need to notice comfort growing with every word I say. What would it be like to relax deeper with every breath you take? What would it be like to relax deeper with every word I say? Ah, <sighs> Now we're going to start by relaxing the body bit by bit and the mind goes with. It's that mental relaxation we're after. Now wherever you go in this hypnotic journey, you're going to be aware of and connected to the sound of my voice. That's right. <laughs> well, here's what's fun about hypnosis. You don't even have to listen, and yet you hear everything. Now, you're not going to be zonked out or unconscious. You're just going to be in this very calm, focused, relaxed place. It's like a state of meditation, a sense of well-being and balance. That's what it is. So go ahead, close your eyes and relax. And we're going to start by relaxing your eyes, just your eyes. I'm going to invite you to relax all the muscles around your eyes to the point that your eyes are so heavy, heavy, relaxed, they're perfectly comfortable. Any tension or stress vanishes to the point that your eyes are so comfortable, they just want to stay closed. That's right. I'm inviting you to relax your eyes completely, heavy, heavy, relaxed, to the point that your eyes are so comfortable, they just stay closed. Relax your eyelids, your eyebrows, your eyelashes, heavy, heavy, relaxed, with a sense of comfort flowing through every muscle. That's right. Letting go, sinking down, feeling so good. Now, in a moment, but not yet, we're going to do something pretty funny. In a moment, I'm going to ask you to try to open your eyes. But you know what? As long as you maintain the relaxation in your eyes, they won't open. And the harder you try to open your eyes, the more stuck shut they become. It's like they're super glued down. The muscles can move, but the eyelids stay closed. Now, this is under your control, 100%. If you wanted to open your eyes, well, duh, of course. Of course you can. However, I'm inviting you to focus your mind in a very different way. I'm inviting you to relax your eyes completely, heavy, heavy, relaxed, to the point that they're so comfortable they just stay closed. And maintain that level of comfort in your eyes. When you successfully exert your control in this way, your eyes won't open. And the harder you try to open your eyes, the more stuck shut they become. So when you're sure, and you know that you are relaxing your eyes completely, heavy, heavy, relaxed, to the point that they stay closed. Give them a good try now. Convince yourself they stay closed. 
Excellent. <clears throat> I knew you'd be good at this. Stop trying. Relax your eyes completely. Let that sense of comfort flow from your eyes down your face, your cheeks, your jaw, your throat, all the way down your shoulders, your back, your chest, your stomach, all the way down to your toes. A warm wave of comfort. That's right. You're concentrating perfectly. You know what's nice about hypnosis? The deeper you go, the better you feel, the more confidence and the more secure. So just let yourself relax deeper. That's right. Now in a moment, but not yet, I'm going to ask you to open up your eyes. This time they're going to open perfectly easily. I'm going to ask you to open your eyes and then immediately close them again. When you close your eyes, you're going to go 10 times deeper relaxed. That's right. So now open your eyes and close 10 times deeper. Feel that wave of comfort flowing and flowing and the deeper you go, the better you feel. It's a sense of calm. It's a sense of well-being. That's right. Now in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes and close them again. And when you close your eyes, you're going to go two times deeper relaxed. Okay, so let's do that now. Open your eyes and close two times deeper. The deeper you go, the better you feel. The better you feel, the deeper you go, the faster you go as you enter a wonderful, comfortable, inner focused mind. That's right. You're concentrating perfectly. Now in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes and close them again. And when you close your eyes, you're just going to go much deeper. Okay, so now open your eyes and close much deeper. That's right, holding on to my voice, connecting to my words. Wherever you go in this hypnotic journey, you stay connected and responsive to the sound of my voice. In fact, you find it a pleasure to listen to the sound of my voice. You're doing great. Now, we're going to relax the arms, completely resting as comfortable as they are. The shoulder, the elbow, the wrist, the fingers, the knuckles, the bones, the muscles, the tendons, the ligaments, relaxing every muscle, relaxing every muscle of your arms, down, down, down to the fingertips, relaxing your arms completely, heavy, heavy, relaxed, down to the cellular level. That's right. Now I just want you to notice how comfortable that feeling is in your arms. And what would it be like if you could take that sense of relaxation and just flow it through every inch of your body and then double it and then double it again and then double it again and then double it again and go deeper and deeper and deeper. That's right. You're concentrating perfectly. Isn't it nice to experience this state of physical relaxed? Now we're going to add this piece called mental relaxed. I'm going to count down from a hundred. As I count down from a hundred, make those numbers a burden, a burden in your mind, a burden you want to get rid of, a burden you can get rid of. By the time I reach 95 or even sooner, the numbers are going to vanish. They're going to grow dim, grow distant, and disappear entirely. And when that happens, notice how good it feels, leaving your mind calm and serene and peaceful just like the surface of a still lake 100 deeper relaxed 99 Relax your mind completely, that's right. 98, the numbers are fading, fading. 97, so calm, deeper and deeper with every breath. 96, down, down, down into comfort, the numbers are fading. 95, feeling safe, calm, and relaxed, focused on the sound of my voice. And again, wherever you go in this hypnotic journey, my voice guides you. So now, 
we're going to talk about a wonderful, resourceful state of mind. It's called optimism. It's called positive expectation. Once upon a time, someone told me something wonderful. You know what they said? They said, what you focus on expands. What you focus on expands. So you've got to focus on the things you want. You've got to focus on the positive. You've got to focus on what you wish were true, even if it isn't true yet. So think about what you want right now in your life, the positive. How would you rather feel? What would you rather do? What kind of changes would you love to see in yourself in this moment? And let's start with the way you'd like to feel. How would it be to wake up and feel absolutely confident? What would it be like to wake up and feel full of positive energy, expecting good things to happen? These good feelings, once you take them on board, they change how you think, they change what you do. So I say, look into your repertoire of life experience and find the good feelings and bring them to the now. A sense of calm, a sense of security, a sense of expecting positive things to happen. Optimism! confidence, calm, and optimistic. What would that be like to go through your day-to-day -day life in a state of feeling safe and feeling confident? Feeling confident changes everything. So why don't you look within and find the confidence and bring it, attach it and bring it and flow it through every moment of your life so that when you see yourself out in the world successful, when this current situation has resolved, and you know that that's gonna be what happens, what you focus on expands. See yourself feeling confident, see yourself healthy, see yourself living a life of abundance and prosperity, see yourself smiling and laughing and full of joy, see yourself living your life feeling the good feelings that go with this movie. That's right. And the soundtrack of this movie is positive energy. The music, the laughter, the happy voice. Feeling good because life is good. You know this to be true. Life is good and we get through it. Life has its ups and downs and we survive and we thrive and we get through it. So see yourself on the other end, living your life full of calm, full of happy, full of confidence, because that's how you really are. These suggestions are settling in deep, deep, deep into your unconscious mind, because your unconscious mind is the part of you that runs how you feel. The conscious mind thinks your unconscious runs the body, the state of mind, the breathing, the heartbeat, the metabolism, all these things so your unconscious mind can make all the adjustments necessary for calm and confidence. Calm and confidence, it's a good thing. What would it be like if it were different and you were exactly who you want to be in this moment and in the future? Once you focus your mind on the things you want, your unconscious mind will take you like an accelerant, like a GPS, directing you to achieve what you're thinking about. So think about something positive. Think about being happy and calm and successful and healthy. Focus on the things you want. You know what I love about this time of year? Everything is so fresh and alive. It's a whole new season. Things are changing. Things are growing. Things are blooming. Everywhere you look, fresh, healthy, new life flowing. There's something about every season of the year which has its own magic and its own power. Springtime, fresh, healthy life 
And you know what's nice about autumn? That's the time of year when it becomes easy to let things go. Look at those trees. Look at those leaves. After they've carried them around for a while and they decided, you know what, it's to my best interest to let it go, you know what happens? It happens. The tree just lets it go. The leaves fly off the tree like they were never even attached. One by one by dozens, the tree says, yeah, I carried that around for a long, long time. It was a part of me. However, don't want it, don't need it, I'm letting it go. And it's gone. No hardship, no struggle. It just happens. I love trees. Trees are survivors, you know. We had a big windstorm the other day, and I was looking at the tree blowing and blowing, and I was looking at the wind and the leaves, and I was worried a little bit. I was like, oh, what's going to happen to the tree? But you know what the tree did? Right in the midst of the strongest gusts of wind, you know what the tree did? The tree started dancing. The tree's like, bring it. I'm strong. And the tree was dancing in the wind. That's right. And then the wind died down. The tree is still there, stronger and more beautiful than ever. And the sun came out and the sky was clear. And the tree is just thriving as always, strong and beautiful and healthy. That's right. You can learn a lot from a tree. So every season has its moments, and every season has its excitement, and every season has all of that life and energy. This is a season right here, right now, for calmness. This is a season right here, right now, for strength. This is a season for power and endurance. And isn't it nice to know you have all these things? Your unconscious mind makes all the adjustments necessary to help you survive and thrive and hold on to calmness, hold on to optimism, and hold on to a sense of positive expectation. These suggestions are settling in on the deepest, deepest internal levels they are flowing down, down, down into the cellular level, changing you, helping you thrive right now. Now, it's important to keep this work in your unconscious. That's where it has the most power. It's important to remember to forget the things you don't need to consciously remember, and you're only going to remember as much as your unconscious believes is useful for your conscious mind to know. That's right, and I agree with that. It's like you have a dream, and it's a beautiful dream. And when you wake up from the dream, you feel so good. You hold on to the good feelings, even as the details of the dream erase themselves. You hold on to the good feelings in the days and weeks to come. Now, in a moment, you're going to be coming up out of hypnosis. When you come up out of hypnosis, you know what? You're going to be feeling so good. You're going to be wide awake, alert, refreshed, feeling simply fantastic. Better than you have felt in a long, long time. Beautiful thoughts in your mind, beautiful feelings in your body. When you come out of hypnosis, you're going to feel simply fantastic. I'm going to count from one to five. And when I get to the number five, that's your invitation to emerge from trance. One, breathing deeper. Two, positive energy flowing through every cell of your body. Positive energy head to toe. That's right. Three, more awake, more aware, more present in this room. Coming up, coming up, emerging from trance. Four, beginning to stretch, beginning to stir, coming up out of hypnosis, emerging from trance. <laughs> That's right, coming up. And five, you can open your eyes, wide awake, alert, refreshed, and feeling simply fantastic. Because you know that your unconscious mind is helping you now to hold on to calm, hold on to confidence, and live your life in the manner you desire, because you can. 
And again, this is Connie Brannan with MindWorks Hypnosis in Bellevue, Washington. And this has been a moment for you to just focus your unconscious on healthy and happy and calm and make some changes on the unconscious level. Now, if you're interested in learning more about hypnosis and the different ways that your mind is powerful, my website is www.mindworkshypnosis.net. And I say thank you for listening.